The 2013 International Boxing Hall of Fame inductees have been announced. Among them, a blood and guts warrior, a talented light heavyweight from North Dakota, one of the greatest fighters South Korea has ever produced, the offspring of a legendary ring announcer who now will join his father in pugilistic immortality, a British boxing scribe, and a no-nonsense referee. Let's get it on with the 2013 inductees into the International Boxing Hall of Fame. Now for the living inductees in the observer and non-participant categories. In the observer category, long-time boxing writer for the London Sun, has covered boxing action for nearly five decades, respected around the world for his knowledgeable in the sport and is known as the voice of boxing in the UK. We welcome journalist Colin Hart. The non-participant, first, former Marine. He was one of boxing's most respected referees, noted for his fairness and professionalism in the ring. Famous around the world for his trademark, pre-fight phrase, let's get it on. We welcome referee Mills Lane. Next in the non-participant category, iconic ring announcer known for his style and class. He has traveled the world for over 30 years and announced many of boxing's biggest fights on Showtime Network. Known for his expression, it's Showtime. We welcome ring announcer Jimmy Lennon Jr. The modern category. Last bout, no earlier than 1943, must have been retired for at least five years. One of the greatest fighters ever from South Korea, reigned as WBA light flyweight champion from 1985 to 1991, and again in 1992 to 93. Was undefeated in 36 bouts over a nine year span. Retired at the age of 29 with a pro record of 38 wins, only one loss. 14 of those wins came by way of knockout and still holds the light flyweight division record of 17 successful title defenses. 2013 Hall of Fame inductee from South Korea, Mi Woo Yu. Next, the fighting pride of North Dakota. He captured the silver medal for the USA in the 1984 Olympic Games. Turned pro in Madison Square Garden in this particular ring in 1984. As a pro, he was the WBA light heavyweight champion twice, 1987 to 1991, and again in 1992 to 1997. The IBF champ, 1996 to 97, and recorded 20 successful title defenses. Also won the WBA cruiserweight title twice, 2000 to 2002, 2006 to 2007. Retired in 2007 with a record of 50 wins, only seven losses, 23 by way of knockout. Entering the Hall of Fame, his first year of eligibility, 2013 Hall of Fame inductee, Virgil Hill. Considered one of boxing's all-time action stars. During his throwing career, he captured two world titles, the IBF Junior Lightweight and the WBC Junior Welterweight Championships. He was in Fight of the Year four times, 1997, 1998, 2002, and 2003. Fought three legendary fights with Irish Mickey Ward. Also holds wins over Tracy Patterson, Gabe Ruiz, and Jesse James Leha. Pro record of 40 wins, nine losses, 31 of his wins came by way of knockout. He passed away three years ago in 2009 at age 37. Entering the Hall of Fame for his first year of eligibility, 2013 Hall of Fame inductee Arturo Thunder Gotti. There you have it, the class of 2013. 
I'm sure the boxing fans are excited of the news of today's announcement. A very popular class of inductees, all made an everlasting contribution to the sport, and I am sure that many boxing fans will be in Canastota to celebrate the entire class of 2013. It's going to be an exciting Hall of Fame weekend, and just like in the past, some of the other great names that will be coming include Carlos Ortiz, Ruben Alaveras, Aaron the Hawk Pryor, Leon Spinks, George Chavallo, popular Jerry Cooney, Jorge Paez, Zab Judah, Wayne McCuller, Buddy McGurk, female boxing champion Mia St. John, current middleweight champion Sergio Martinez, former champion middleweight champion Julian Jackson, another female boxing star Lucia Riker, and many more. And as in the past, the greatest names of boxing from Marvin Hagler, Sugar Ray Leonard, Lennox Lewis, Roberto Duran, who have been here in the past, many of them will be here for the induction weekend to celebrate the 2013 induction weekend to pay tribute to these particular inductees. And it looks like it's going to be an exciting weekend with the biggest names of boxing turning out for the 24th annual Hall of Fame induction weekend. Thank you for attending the press conference of today's announcement.